What's going on, guys? Hubble here again. Croak seed. I found quite a bit of those. I'm still working on it. Um, I'm hoping to put up more and more videos on how to get all of them. Um, I highly doubt I'm going to be able to get it all done, though. 900 seeds and an awful hell of a lot of seeds. But... <clears throat> Now that, there's also a shrine right here, which is nice. So this one is going to be in the Gerudo Desert, right east of the southern oasis. <clears throat> oh. oh, okay. It's not going to let me do it without the Noble Pursuit. That's shady. Uh, great. Alright, well. Looks like I'm going to get the Noble Pursuit, and then I'm going to head back over here. So hopefully this doesn't take too long, because this is... I just wanted to get the shrine done and show you where that Kurok seed was. Um, but it looks like you have to do a side quest in order to get into the shrine, which is stupid. So now i got to put my other gear back on so I can enter the city. The back and forth is basically like your standard Zelda game, which I like, but it's it comes to a point where you just want to do certain things and you get screwed out of being able to do it. So secret shops down there, so alcohol is down here. I have that backwards. Nope. I Actually, what had happened was... Halfway through. Oh, I guess that's not bad. So this has turned from a shrine video into a ice hunting video. Um, this is basically going to just be a side quest video, I guess, so that you guys can see how to get this done in order to get to the shrine, and then I will do a shrine video. Uh, <laughs> kind of backwards. So now going f to the north house, I know I've been out this way before. Um, There shouldn't be too many enemies rolling around. And even the ones that are roaming around, you should be able to avoid them if you don't want to fight them. Uh, the other thing that is out here too is uh, 
For anybody looking for Kurok seeds. There is another one out here, too. So, this is where this Kurok seed will be. If you choose to come out this way to do the ice house to get the shrine, I'm kind of I'm trying to quest for all the shrines at this particular point in time. Um, there's 120, and I'm very far off of that, um, which kind of upsets me because I'm trying to do 100% completion on this game. Um, I am far behind, very far behind compared to everybody else, just because of work schedule and everything else. But <clears throat> so here's the ice house. Sell her oh. to her. Blah 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 blah. Actually, blah blah blah. Big ass block of eyes, holy crap. <laughs> so obviously you can't run with it because you'll end up dropping it. Um you stay in the shade, it doesn't melt. So another trick would be to wait till dark. Or just keep following all the pathways to stay out of the sun as much as possible. Um, kind of like a little mini puzzle. But there are enemies, so that could pose a problem. Got me with that. Yeah, okay, so since we know there's enemies and I still gotta carry this, we are gonna destroy them. Whoa! Didn't even get that hit in, that's garbage. So that's where the camel comes in really useful. It's starting to get dark, which would be a hell of a lot easier to carry this ice. Because <laughs> it'll get cooler out. <laughs> but you still gotta stay out of the sun. Ice was ginormous. Now it's really not that, not that big. Oh, wrong button here. Uh, I need to change my. 
close because it's getting cold. Oh, I can't do that. Oh, I can't because uh, I gotta give it to that lady. She'll freak out. Looks like it cooled off enough where it doesn't matter. <laughs> Don't want to hit the ice. Hey, I'll throw my brock of ice. <laughs> right over there so let's hurry up and get this over with before it freeze to death back down over there. <clears throat> Just go back to Pokemon later. I was waiting for a Pokemon to in front of the uh, So now that I have that over with, I can change my gear. <clears throat> Is that enough? Is enough. I need something like this. problem with this one is you gotta go such a long distance because you can't just fast travel because you didn't get to do the shrine. And I don't have any... walruses or... I don't even have enough shield power to go through that. So... Hopefully you guys have made it this far, and you're going to stick around to the end of this. Um, it's going to take about a minute and a half, two minutes just to walk down there, but... Unless I find a seal. This one is really, oh, it's the other side. It's already passed it. Hypermelon, blah, blah, blah. Straight this way. <clears throat> so hopefully once this is done, <clears throat> I won't have to come back over this way until after I'm done with the shrine. Um, but we'll see. This is a 
such a long way. <clears throat> now I'm wondering though, do I have to be in the traditional female outfit or can I be in my normal clothing? I'm assuming since I talked to her, I'd have to be in my traditional woman's clothing. But I don't know. We'll see. So, hopefully, this video has helped you guys out so far. Um, we'll stick around to the end. I, I really don't like making these long videos because they tend not to do well. Um, they end up with a lot of spoilers and blah blah blah. People have said. They don't like watching the longer videos, so. Um, unfortunately, this one has to be a longer video because it goes through everything. Uh, but we'll see how it does. Uh, hopefully, it doesn't backfire out here. Should have grabbed the sea lion, sand seal, whatever. Problem is, I just don't want to break all my shields getting all the way out here because it wears down the durability on your shields, and I don't have the Herulian shield yet. So I know there's going to be a lot of you out there being like, man, you're dumb, you should have just got a seal. Um, but I don't want to waste my shields. <clears throat> Jesus, so far away. some other stuff I need to get done too. Like I'm planning on doing the other divine beast, the elephant, sometime. Um, either today or tomorrow. Probably gonna be tomorrow. Um, just cause I got some stuff I gotta do for work yet and <clears throat> other quests I wanna get done too. <clears throat> the Divine Beast is nice to have, though, because it gives you full health if you do die. It's like a one-time charm deal, kind of like a fairy. Um, so. <sighs> now get off my fucking entrance to the shrine. Come on, chop chop. What? Run! <gasps> Bye, Felicia! Bye! So anyways guys, that's how you get the perfect drink quest completed so you can get into the shrine. So on that note, like, comment, subscribe, let me know what you think, and then tune into the next video which will be this shrine itself. Hellboy out.